you have to think your modeling spoon as a, as a beveler. You have to pay attention to which line, which side of the line you want to bevel. See here, this this is, and here it's this side. See. Basically, we're just building major structures at this point. Now we're going to start building all our little minor structures. And we can do that with our stylus in, probably a little bit better. And it may look to you like I'm making a mess. But you can't really hard to make a mess on on these horns as as we're going to show. Now, if your leather is too dry, it won't take modeling like this. And if it's too wet, it's, it it'll start wrinkling and it won't it won't it won't accept the modeling that way either. So you have to have your leather just right, and that's where the getting that right moisture content in the beginning comes in handy.